Hello. I'm going to do a review of the Z glasses by Zetronics. These are the uh, camera glasses that have a camera in the middle. High definition, 1080p, and this is what they look like. So, the thing about these is, is you can tell if you're really looking, you can tell that there's a camera here, okay? And that's okay. But at a distance, and if people aren't paying attention, you can't tell if there's a camera there. And that's why I got it. Because I wanted to go into certain places, and take video, without having to do this. You know, that attracts a lot of attention. If I can just do this, just wear the glasses, pick up an item and read it, an item. I can do videos about products and things without having to buy the item. I can do it right there in the store. So that's why I got this. And you can even take it, take these glasses and, and hold them like this and record. And yeah, you're, this is obvious, but it's better than holding a camera. So that's why I got them. Uh, the picture quality is pretty good, and I'm going to show you that in a second. Um, the glasses themselves are pretty thick. And here, I'll give you a closer view, but this part is pretty thick. They look kind of like odd. They're a little odd looking. But then again, they blend in too, so I like them. And I, would, I like the picture quality. So what I will say is that the picture quality is good if there's a lot of light, like outside. Also, the, the one problem though is it has kind of a fisheye look to it. This lens is kind of bent. So I kind of like that. It kind of looks neat, but I don't want it all the time. It gets annoying after a while. So you'll see that in the video here in a second. So it does have a fisheye effect and then things kind of bend around on the sides. Um, video quality is good, in light. It doesn't do well when you shake, when you do this. It doesn't do very well. You have to hold your head very still and when you film uh, and tape, you need to move like very slowly. Otherwise it looks, it looks some of the video I've seen out there on, the, on YouTube looks terrible because it's just jerking all, all over. So that's the main points to these glasses. They've got good video. It needs a lot of light. Doesn't do real well indoors. I'll show you that and don't you have to hold it very still. Also, you can kind of tell, I mean, it's not a hidden camera, but it's there. One concern I have with these glasses is, considering the price, it would be pretty easy to break them. If you were to just pull, they're not, they're like any other glasses. They're nice, they're decent, but if you were to pull just too much or crash or on a bike or something, they're going to break and you've lost a very expensive pair of glasses. So, when I use them, it came with this case. I'm always putting them back in this case, so I feel a lot better when they're in there. This case could still be crushed, but it's better than anything else I have. Now I will say that this power button here, if you hit it once, it will vibrate and start recording and you see the green light. If you hit it again, now it's recording, it should stop. Every now and then I found that I was hitting that button accidentally. It's pretty easy to hit. Not a big problem, but you have to be careful.
Here's fun.